Hey guys, welcome back to another Stay Hot Shot. I'm Matthew Sponauer. And today we're going to be talking about Ron Rivera, his time with the Panthers, and whether or not I think he's a good fit with Washington going forward. Without further ado, let's get into it. Let's go be smart, make a good decision. Now let's go. Let's go. Take it. Let's go. Point seven yards per rush. And then there's Newton, who's got another first down. Everybody who knows me uh, knows that I'm a pretty big Panthers fan, so I have strong feelings about Ron Rivera, and I do think, overall, he's a good coach. He's one of those guys who it seems like everybody likes to play for, and that might not seem like it's important, but what he does for a team's culture matters a lot. When he was with the Panthers, it always felt like even if they weren't great, it was a fun team to root for and that they liked playing for the team. Ron Rivera's main deal is creating culture with a team, and the Panthers definitely felt like a unit that played well together during his time with the Panthers. Even when the team wasn't fantastic, because they were a little bit up and down during Ron Rivera's tenure, uh, it felt like they played as a unit, and it felt like they had an identity as a team. He's also a risk taker in the best possible way. When it comes to going forward on fourth down and whether or not you should punt, a lot of coaches are too conservative, but Ron Rivera picked up the name Riverboat Ron uh, for a reason. There's sometimes where it's good to be a little bit more conservative, but sometimes it was the right call to just trust in your guys. And I've always felt like Ron Rivera did a good job of knowing when to trust his guys. That's not to say that Ron is a perfect coach because I think we only had three winning seasons under him during the nine years he was with Carolina. I don't feel like he gives you a major X's and O's advantage. You'll see a lot of these coaches like Sean McVay or Kyle Shanahan feel like they have this new age offense that they're pushing. It never really was the case with Rivera. And a lot of the offensive coordinators that he brought in ran very basic, not amazing offenses that I felt like held us back sometimes. I can't deny that I think Cam Newton may have carried that offense during his tenure a lot. And then when Cam ended up getting hurt, uh, it was pretty rough. And I don't know if I want to blame Ron Rivera for the offense being bad when Cam Newton ended up getting hurt in 2018 or so. The other big problem I have with him is that even though he was a risk taker, there would be times where the Panthers would jump out to big leads and they would get ridiculously conservative on defense and play like total prevent and let teams back into games that they didn't need to be let back into. And this was when the Panthers had a really talented defense, so it made no sense to do. I remember one time in particular, Panthers go up 7-35 to on the Giants, and the Giants bring it all the way back 35-35, and Cam Newton has to drive down the field and get him like a 63-yard field goal to win the game. Overall, though, I feel like his time with the Panthers was a success. We were like a player or two away in 2015 from having arguably the greatest team of all time, and it just didn't work out. And we did make the playoffs four out of the nine years, five out of the nine years, which is better than some teams can say. You see the playoff droughts that a lot of teams have. But in the end, the team kind of stopped getting better, and it felt like we were stagnant, and it didn't seem like Rivera fit the direction that the team needed to head. So moving on from him, even though I think he was successful and even though I think he's a good coach, made sense. And that brings us to his time in Washington. If there's any organization that needed somebody to come in and really set the tone and build a culture for them, it was Washington. What the Redskins have needed is a culture change and it starts and ends with our head coach. I think Washington has struggled a lot with that. And even if you brought in somebody who was running a really new age offense, if they couldn't fix the culture problems that Washington has had, I don't know if it would matter. And that's what I trust Ron Rivera to do. You can already tell that team has a different aura about them. They already made the playoffs, even if it was because their division was terrible. So I just have a good feeling about them going forward under Rivera because he fits what they need. He's just the type of guy that players want to rally around. And I think that brings a lot to a team. We definitely don't know everything there is to know about Washington going forward. And they have a lot of things to figure out. But I trust that they're in good hands with Ron Rivera, head coach. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and tell me what you want to see next. See you all next time.